What is up ladies and gentlemen, we're back here for yet another awesome video and uh, it is actually right after school and you guys know what we do right after school on a beautiful day. We go fish. And so I've got a couple, I've got one golf course that has a couple ponds on it that's fairly close to here. And uh, I'm going to go hit it up. I'm taking one rod and one lure. And uh, I've got about an hour to fish and then I've got to head back and uh, come back and do some other stuff. But I've got about one hour, one rod, one reel, one lure. One everything pretty much and one scale that is all I'm taking I'm not taking a backpack or anything I will put a scale in my pocket my phone and wallet will be obviously all in my pockets as well and uh, and I'm gonna go try to catch some fish I'm taking the GoPro chesty and that is all I'm taking this is a very minimalist fishing uh, trip so tag along with me thank you guys for watching thank you guys for uh, clicking on the video but I want to make one one quick announcement uh, for those of you who are actually a couple quick announcements those of you who are new I do have a 1,500 subscriber giveaway that is still going on right now and I'll be drawing the winner on April 13th you guys know that if you guys watch the giveaway video if you haven't signed up for the giveaway video and you want to you want to try to win some Guggen baits some apparel some lures go click the link down in the description and it'll take you straight to the giveaway video you can watch that you can subscribe right now you can do a whole shebang and uh, and then you'll be entered and you could win all that awesome stuff all one winner and uh, and then uh, imitator baits my bait company we have just released the brand new imitator baits bed jig which is a jig specifically designed for bed fishing it's all white completely white the the jig head the skirt everything is completely white um, and uh, and the reason why is because a lot of people like myself like to be able to see the bait and see every move that your bait makes when bed fishing because when bed fishing uh, the bass love to short strike lures and they don't want it they they don't like to eat the entire lure you know so you want to see when that bass has the lure in their mouth to be able to set the hook and so we created a lure uh, a jig specifically designed for that application and they're very limited we've only got a couple of them right now and uh, once they're gone they're gone for this year we might bring them back next year but once they're gone this year they are gone for at least another year so go pick them up while you can pick up one pick up two Pick up all of them, you know, pick up as much as it will let you pick up. So, thank you guys for watching, and uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put the camera down, grab my stuff, and let's go fish. All right, you guys, well, we just, uh, I just made my way down here to this pond. This is actually on the golf course. There's a, uh, the golfing thing is right here, uh, like where the people hit the golf ball off the tee. And uh, there's two two pretty decent sized ponds here, and there are a whole bunch of bass fry down here. And I've got one rod, one lure. I've got about an hour or so to fish, maybe not even that long. And uh, like I said, there's a couple decent ponds. I'm gonna see if I can just fish them. Not even sure if I'm allowed to fish them really, but we're gonna, you know, give it a shot. And if we get kicked out, we get kicked out. So other than that. We'll uh, see if we can catch some fish. Oh, we got a fish. Oh, we got a fish, guys. We have got a fish. There we go. Nice one. Nope. Not too bad, just about a pound, little guy. There we go, first fish. Chatterbait right there, shad looking chatterbait, obviously you guys can tell. Oh, there we go, look at that. Not a bad fish by any means, you know, decent little guy, but uh, awesome, there we go. That is fish number one, and I was just saying I've got like pretty much five, five to seven minutes or so to fish. So I'm gonna see if I can catch one more, and uh, 
and then if I can catch one more oh I got one I got one oh yes they are like schooled up over here that's awesome I haven't even obviously stopped recording and we automatically got another fish this one is a little bit bigger too there we go oh yeah that one that's a chunky one that looks like a male all right guys i'm going to talk to you guys about something this is what it looks like whenever they are getting ready to spawn pre-spawn right here this tail uh the tail will start to get messed up and everything fat fish too smoke the chatterbait i was just kind of doing a little bit something different i was kind of reeling it a little bit and then jerking it a couple times and then reeling it again and he smoked it that's awesome that's two fish in like four minutes and i had i've been here for an hour and hadn't had a whole bite so man i was hoping i was gonna be able to make a video today and here we go hey guys well i am uh, that's gonna have to conclude uh this video i hope you guys enjoyed at least i did not get kicked out on uh during this video and even at this pond so that means so far i can still come back and we're gonna be good they haven't seen really seen me yet so um this is the bait i want to go over very briefly on how i caught those two fish really quick at this golf course pond just using this uh z-man chatterbait this is a z-man one not an imitator baits one and uh yeah i don't really have a reason for using this one but just kind of wanted to try out a, uh, a shad pattern chatterbait right now because a lot of the chatterbaits I've been using as of recently have been uh, bluegill colored so that's that one a little swim bait white swim bait on the back of there and uh, this is a seven foot three inch medium heavy right there 13 fishing to five black 13 fishing origin a uh, bait casting reel with 50 pound uh, Cabela's braid. So pretty sweet combo right there. Caught a couple fish at some golf course ponds. Definitely be coming back here very soon. So stay tuned for that. And uh, other than that, I'm gonna peace out right here, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. And uh, I'll catch you guys on the next episode of LMB Nation. Peace, guys.